guys, welcome to another episode in the deep playthrough of Hitman World of Assassination. Uh, in, the, in between episodes, I um, restarted from the uh, start of the level, not from the, the one save. Uh, on Master Difficulty level, you only have one save, and that's where I mostly started from in the previous couple of episodes. But this shortcut over here somehow. I unlocked it after using that save and then it didn't persist throughout restart somehow really weird so what I did is um, restarted from the beginning doing some preparatory work uh, like getting this disguise, uh, disabling the security cards, uh, cameras, disabling the server uh, and making a save over here so this is also a little bit in the middle of the uh, level we have like Carl Ingram guy up there and the Marcus Stupson guy up there <coughs> and now we can continue with the um, aim that um, or with the objective that I was doing in the previous episode which is basically also messing about with uh, challenges a bit um, uh, clearing up challenges as they go but the main one I was focusing on was finding somewhere lethal poison i already checked out explored the up to level two quite thoroughly downwards i didn't see any uh, lethal poison while exploring that although i was not really specifically looking for it at that time but uh, now i'm going to explore further level three and upwards we already did a bit of that in the uh, previous episode um, getting lethal poison to uh, eventually do this challenge uh, which will uh, if i have lethal poison uh, which will then probably also clear uh, if i kill a target with lethal poison which will also clear this one because i think you get this one if you have this one this one this one this one and this one the classical kills like accident, headshot, drowning, lethal poison, and garrots. Then you also get this one. And then I also am hoping if I poison the Mark Stuyvesen guy, um, over here at the bar, I just have to get uh, from storage some kind of a whiskey bottle, and then I'm sure we can uh, give him uh, serve him a drink spiked then this one will also clear so then we have four challenges in one so that is the aim but for now indeed let's explore third floor and upwards uh, and I want to check one other a door that I opened in between episodes which I didn't do before I'm curious where it leads to but let's explore these uh, upper floors and see if we can find a bottle or something poisonous. Right, for example, this one. Does this... I have no idea whether these are enforcers. This is all new to me. Ah, you can actually climb this. Man, there are so many more ways to get around in this game. It's pretty interesting. Um, all right. Ah, I felt like a guy is staring, but that's uh, 40 seconds. Um, reflection in that door over there. By the way, on that shortcut, that ladder that we, um, where we started this episode just uh, a couple of minutes ago, it's really weird because I opened it normally shortcuts in this game and i do like the mechanic they are persistent so even if you don't save the game once you open them up if you quit the game and you restart it it remains opened up like a ladder that is uh, um, extended downwards or a door that is opened um, but this specific shortcut was not persistent and i think it is because i opened it up after saving the game i think it only works if you start afresh from the start of the level i don't know but i was thinking okay it's not persistent so then i start over and then i open up that specific ladder 
and then it should be persistent because it is pre any safe but the weird thing is that once I uh, in between episode now started from the beginning and I got to that letter it already was down so what I think happens is that once I activated it after the save or in this uh, yeah after a save the game remembers it that it's being uh, activated because it's also a challenge that is marked off but then when you reload that save later on because you did it later on in the save not prior to that save then the save overrides um, the clearing of that shortcut so to say but then when I started from the beginning, the game did remember that it was already cleared. So I didn't have to kick down that ladder again, so to say. It's a little bit hard to explain. But I think it has to do if you open up a shortcut after a save, and that save doesn't have the shortcut baked into it, and then you reload that save. Uh, then the save overrides the opened up shortcut, and it remains closed, so to say. Anywho. I was looking for, I'm more and more getting familiar with the layout and like all levels in, or with more levels, at the start I'm a little bit, um, it's a little bit intimidating with all the options etc. But once you get to know them, there really you get to see all the options that it brings. For instance, these um, elevator shafts you can open up with the server and also the interconnectedness of all the rooms hey oh shit who are you yeah i was thinking about uh, i was this is an um an enforcer i was not yeah or i i, I just didn't know i was not counting on him not being an enforcer but there is actually also a challenge related to that so let's do that now uh, it's a feat, I'm sure. Here, kicking a guy down an elevator shop. So let's kick that guy. Normally, I am really not for. Um, I should start this thing. Taking out innocents. For collateral damage, I'm really trying to avoid it as much as possible, but this guy is just annoying. So let's kick him down an elevator shaft. Where was he? There he is. Some strange noises here. Looking into it. Over. Over. Show yourself. Fuck me. All right. He's not really um, turning as I would like him to. Let's try that again. Uh, and 
then once he returns, I'm gonna throw a coin near the elevator and that would at least uh, get so his back face to me. I'm cool, I'm keeping my cool. Over. Over. Keep your cool, over. Come on now, come on. Alright, but it will be tricky because as soon as he turns around, like right about now. What? Shit, it was too late. Huh? Ah. Okay. Nice, this is what I want. Do I know you? Fuck me, man. I want to stay silent assassin. This is harder than I expected. Because he just doesn't turn around enough. Get behind him. I could try a different um, outfit, of course. Yeah, maybe let's do that, but I'm pretty sure. Guy over here, maintenance guy. All right. Yes. What the hell? Where is his disguise? All right. This is a little bit weird. Did I drop it? Ah, this is by the way the um, open door that I want to figure out where does it end up let's do that now so again i'm being a little bit all over the place but yeah you can easily distract it all right i do uh recognize this maybe oh shit Anyways, maybe take this guy's disguise. I did have a technician disguise somewhere as well, but I know where I left it. Let's see. Oh, it smells delicious. Is it nearly done? Are you kidding me? No, it needs to simmer for perfection. It must not be disturbed. You speed it up and you break all the glorious flavors. You'll become mush. I got a call from upstairs that the guest is hungry. When that clock rings, Mr. Ingram can eat, and it will be like the angels touched his palate. Heavenly. You understand? But isn't it just a stew? I'll get up. All right, the penthouse chef is preparing a meal for Ingram and has set up a timer to let him know when the food is ready to be plated. All right, interesting. Um, his disguise, I think, is also a challenge in itself, the chef disguise, so I will also be taking that one. Um, a lot of challenges to do. I have to go for a very quick sanitary stop. We'll be back in 10 seconds. Sorry for that. Um, let's quickly take this chef's disguise. Out of my kitchen, you imbecile. 
I don't want your filthy words contaminating my food, idiot. If you want something simple, very, very simple. Chef actually is uh, an enforcer, but this is a way to lure Ingram apparently. Let Ingram know the food is ready, and we can poison him. Ah, he's not an enforcer. Let's see if we can lure him down here, one way or the other. Here we go. Alright, I'm still looking for lethal poison by the way. There's a medic red poison everywhere, but no lethal. Hey, you! Did you have anything to do with this? Ah, fuck me, I forgot. I thought he's not an enforcer. Um. Hey, stop! Alright, I lost my. Uh, Pattern, but this is only messing about with challenges anyways so it's not the end of the world i will not i was considering starting over but let's leave it for now because uh yeah it's just about yeah or shall i start over it's not even that much work or at all. So let's start over. Let's just try to stick to Silent Assassin. I just need to remain focused and become good. Because it is not that hard, but it is, even if you're not an, if they're not an enforcer, and it, I find it a little bit over exaggerated game mechanic, but if you turn on a, a, a distraction, even if it's something Innocent, like an ice machine going out of control. Then the um, I still wonder where that's. It's not this one. Where did I leave that tech disguise? Uh, but anyways, if you do any distraction and you linger around or you're in the neighborhood, they do become suspicious of you. And I find it for an ice cream machine maybe a little bit uh, exaggerated. Anywho, the ID is... Yeah, I wanted to quickly check where did event security... Penthouse staff, I also did... Ashen suit, so that's the uh, standard suit. I'm pretty sure I also got uh, a technician suit. Apparently not, that's really weird. I just didn't, you have to put it on for it to actually pop up. But that's so weird, because this guy over here, there was an event, uh, a, a technician here. I took him out and put him in this cupboard. Ah, here we are. So it was here. So now we can just as well immediately see if that guy is now an enforcer with our new disguise. Is he? I don't think he is. Pick that 
that up? Why I find that so obnoxious? Why do they see me? Ah, there was a guy over there. If we didn't see him. Huh? All right, the coin dropped. We've got a possible intruder. Ah, uh, in the shaft. So that's a lost coin. Come on, give me a break. Come on, man. Why aren't you getting in position? Whoa. And another one. Jeez. Right, why? He's, not, he's just not going close enough. Ah, you can actually uh, move levels over here. That's pretty handy. If I throw something against the wall, I doubt he will be distracted by that. Find out what that was. Loud and clear. Alright, I did distract somebody, no idea who. sitting pretty sneakily. He would have spotted me. Anyhow, you tell me. I have no clue. Yeah, maybe if I throw the coin and it doesn't fall in the elevator shaft, but it actually stays on the ledge and he picks it up, then he could maybe move forward a bit. Let's try that. Maybe placing a weapon there. That's it. Let's do that. Go all the way at the edge. Like so. And now something to lure him. Okay. What? A weapon? What nugget just drops a weapon? Come on, why can't I fucking drop him down? Seriously? I don't understand. That's the hard part. Get, go, go, getting go. away at the right moments before triggering an alert. But he does come over to investigate, but not trigger an alert. Alright, here it comes. Oh, come on over, dude. He's gone! How the hell did he manage that? Nah, they're simply not coming over close enough. To be honest, I find it again 
a little bit of annoying uh, mechanic. In my view, I got these guys close enough to the uh, in my view I got them close enough to them in and I just didn't get that option don't ask me why all right what's this where the hell are we now ah this is that entrance part oh shit be sure there will be enforcers here Just checking out where this all leads, what kind of shortcuts this brings. Yeah, this is pretty handy, you can really from the start, you can get super easy uh, access to the higher floors. Wonder whether this is the only elevator shaft or whether there are actually more. I will be spotted now. If they're still in an alert mode. That one security guy is gone actually. Let's get into another disguise to lower the suspicion. So where is that guy now? Are they still in an alert phase? He is now randomly running around. I could bump into him, and he is an enforcer, he does see through my disguise. Alright, I have no clue how to get that guy close enough. to the uh, to the elevator to push him in ah he's back over there maybe uh, shooting somewhere but again See? Nothing here, Command. Moving on. Area clear, sir. We gotta find the punk. Search the area. They're not even... It's super annoying. They're not walking through the area of... Or through the location of the bullet impact. And now somehow... Yeah. It is still opened up, this shortcut, but it did have the, uh, it looked visually, it looked closed. But I didn't have to break it open again, so that is probably just a visual glitch, that it resets. By the way, there's one other thing I noticed in between episodes. It's a pretty cool detail in the distance over there. You see these... Uh, That's probably flare gas or 
oil drilling um, sites where they burn off uh, excess gas or something. But it's a nice little detail. It does give you a little bit of uh, feel that you are indeed in the Middle East. for if you want to play uh, suit only which I'm still I didn't attempt yet all right so we have also where does that lead uh, that is the guard that I saw from upstairs I think earlier or the staircase um, any you suit only I didn't try yet and I am a little bit annoyed that I cannot get that guy in an elevator shop should not be this hard I would say Six moving in a possible enemy target. Over. Over. You're surrounded. Huh? Hmm. Here, and there's just no way. Ah, great. There is just no way. This here the challenge. I cannot imagine just dropping him in. Um, man, this is annoying. Ah, it does uh, clear the challenge. So the only thing you need to do push or dump some anyone down an elevator shaft. All right, so that one is done. And now we let's get the cook disguise and search more for the. Uh, Our Royal Highness never about it before. Yeah, Where was that kitchen? I don't even remember how I got to that kitchen. Get a warning. I think I'm in love. How much? Who are you? Hey, you! All right, good to know. That guy is an enforcer. <coughs>
we go. No more kidding around. doesn't really knock anyone out. We are still silent session. is not the first time it's so fucking annoying if you pick up an item you don't put it in your inventory apparently it automatically uh, is equipped it stays equipped so then if you want to knock somebody out it's an accidental kill and especially if you jam a screwdriver in somebody's shoulder that is if you don't expect it super annoying anyways i have no clue why that guy first got suspicious of me and now it seemed like he walked straight past me and he was not faced at all something harder than an apple so yeah I have no idea uh, I can of course look it up on the map through wind or I can just open the doors through ah this is a toilet Oh, wrong button. 
Yes, here we go. Disguise yourself as the chef. But we are still looking. For poison. The new World Watch, worldwide news press. A new racing challenger appears. Nations grip. Grits. Worldwide news to your doorstep. Diplomatic incident between the two strongest nations create panic on international markets. America recently voted anti-corruption law brings 76 politicians in jail. Swedish embassy in Wafrasa under investigation. And that's probably, uh, what was it, the Morocco level? Marrakesh. Italy in shock over recent dramatic events. So that was the, uh, I assume, the Sapienza dealings. Really nice to read about 47s stuff in the newspaper. So we can let uh, the guy come over. What up, chef? A meaty bow and a frying pan. a dish there is something related to this there's also a challenge to this one I am pretty damn sure ah, this is a chandelier accident that I was trying to do I think in the previous episode or maybe one before There is also something with this kitchen. I am pretty certain of that. With an NMS. In the picture. find it anymore. Ah, here's an NNS. Obtain the penthouse key. Right, that really is like an objective that you cannot really derive from the picture itself. So maybe there's no challenge related to this one. What's this? Obtain a scimitar. Ah, this is only obtaining it. I thought I had to kill it with the scimitar. And they killed the targets. I did obtain it. Unlock the ladder shortcut at the ventilation area behind the penthouse. This is exit by helicopter, I'm sure. There is some other ladder somewhere. On the roof. Open all electric window shutters using the phone. Ah, I already did that. Was not expecting that at all. This is maybe escaping by air balloon. All right, anywho, we can lure him over here to take him out. But the question remains, where is lethal poison? That is the big question. Jump this little railing. 
Are they suspicious? No, he's not. And there's even a pipe over there to get higher up. Alright, I think that other shortcut, it's over here. Ah, and there is an air balloon. Ah, fuck 